Medical Center. This is the classroom I utilized the past two summers, and we always have a group of kids that come through, man, especially since, you know, going through the pandemic and whatnot. So we've been navigating. Uh, my mask is, is on the table, so I have to wear my mask. But we have a, a classroom filled with great supplies and from donations from the community that we're able to supply the kids with uh, materials they could use to make their projects. So we've been doing uh, poetry. For me, go back, we back up. So my summer program is called Words of Art. So we incorporate poetry and um, visual art. And what I do, I teach about to write poems. And I have a certain technique that I use. And we pull from the poem images and stuff like that to transfer to a project. And we've done several so far, but our main project that I do is with the mask. And I'm gonna go into detail about that. Well, a little detail, but y'all, this is what I provide for your program. So you have a summer camp program, you need somebody who, who's exuberant, <laughs> energetic, you know, this guy right here. You should, you, should, you should hire this dude, you should contract this dude to come to your summer camp or your school uh, to do poetry, uh, art, combine, or just poetry, either way it goes, I make sure the kids have fun. So, you know, thank you for your time. Bow. Be loved, be great, be kind, be on the grind. See you next time. Peace. Yeah, you can see this is the classroom that I use. This is my second year here. Just finished cleaning up uh, the kids. Uh, it's finished up. We've been working on masks. And, uh, this is some of the sketches that they're going how they're gonna decorate their mask. I'm gonna paint tomorrow. Some ideas. Yeah, can't wait to do that. I showed them a sample of mine from last year. did that last year. So that's going to be like the finished product. So yeah, that's what we're working on.